flexible learning environments offer real alternatives for young people who are unable to succeed in the traditional classroom. Learning is tailored to individual needs and interests in diverse and innovative ways. Through a flexible learning enrolment, young people are achieving learning outcomes and moving confidently into further education or employment. Coming back to school when your previous experience wasn't a happy one it takes a huge amount of courage and sticking it out takes a lot of resilience. You do need to have your youth workers in a program like this. You do need to have your teachers who are teaching the subjects and have an understanding of SACE. You need to have your people who work within a in job network who can who can work with the students, people with an outdoor recreation background who can do the community-based learning program and, and get the students out of their comfort zone and develop absolutely lifelong skills that the students need. The relationship between the teacher and the learner in that kind of environment is, is critical to whether or not that young person or older person is able to stay. Some of our students had never achieved anything, like completing a subject or, or anything like that. So when that did happen, there was that real sense of achievement. It's like, I can do this. And that often starts a process that when they actually do achieve something, then suddenly it's like, oh, I can do the next thing. We work with the, with the families to try to support them and it may take a few years and it might be adjusting and just working on the wellbeing side rather than the educational side and then you know there may be that flicker of hope. What we want is to try to provide proactive support for those young people to develop um, behaviours and attitudes that are much more conducive to operating in a school community, in the local community in the workplace, wherever they want to be. Being able to work with principals from similar schools is very, very important. We actually can't solve these issues in our own schools. Our funding models make it tricky. It's not something that I've necessarily been able to do on, in my own school on my own. I do it because I have my colleagues supporting me. From a community point of view, it has high credibility partly because of the clear outcomes for students um, and partly because um, the program operates so effectively in the community that many people come into contact with, with the program and with, this, and with the young people uh, in, a range of, in a range of ways. The work that's happening, particularly using online learning tools, um, that co-constructed curriculum using iPads and iPhones to capture learning as it's happening, as they're going, is just fantastic. Young people have really spoken positively and, and, and often quite emotionally about, about the change that WAVE made to their lives and to their, and, and, and to their futures. And they often are sort of saying, well, you know, that's how it was then because I was under all these things. But through WAVE, I was able to work through a number of those issues and look at me now. I make the most out my day, that's no word of a lie No, it's good to have a go, then you're saying that you never try Never take my time, always get up and go Unless it comes to a verse, one to work on my flow I'm certain to know why that you're leaving this way There's a part of me that thinks you're determined to stay I'm never earning a wage with this hole in my pocket My day job will consist with only making a profit So I start from the bottom, work my way to the top I bring the light to the shade, but the timing is wrong So come along, follow me to our pockets of fat You couldn't buy happiness even if you have your cash and I'm so mad from the way I was brought back and thoughts that are so far from being relaxed leave it at that and put the pressure on me all in a day's work never what it's supposed to be we out